Hey, guys. Hey, you want to fuck off? Oh, really? Yeah, I want you to fuck off right now. Would you vote for Hillary Clinton if she run in 2020? No, fuck that. No? No, get the fuck out. Why? Get the fuck out. Why? Fuck you, Infowars, you're all pieces of shit. Fuck you. You don't even know me. I knew you were with fucking Infowars and Alex Jones. You're all pieces of shit. Fuck you, go home. All right, wow. This is, okay, revolution. Revolutionary student tables. Pretty aggressive. All right. Hi, ladies. Hi. <laughs> um, what do you guys think? Do you think that Hillary Clinton would stand a chance if she run, ran in 2020? Yeah, we're just trying to sell cookies. I have no political opinions at this time. Yeah, I could understand you guys being a little afraid to speak your voice when you're sitting next to these people over here. Alex Jones is a fucking freak. Do you feel a little afraid to voice your opinion? Would you like to buy some cookies? It seems like it. Wow. Seems like they can't even talk because you guys are being so aggressive over here. Like, seriously. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> there it is, guys. The revolutionary student front. Oh, yeah. These are like the free speech bullies on campus here. They don't let their... Uh, classmates voice their opinion without being harassed and bullied into silence. Crazy. So are the Hillary questions a cover? Or did you really come here to Well, I guess you wouldn't know because you wouldn't even talk to me. Like, maybe if you wanted to talk to me, then you would find out. Did you go ahead and tell George there was a rape in my chair right now? <laughs> Yeah, why do you why do you need to come up and put your hand in the camera if you already have a mask covering your because face? I didn't consent to this and my friends didn't consent to this. Okay, but you're getting up right in front of the camera, yeah. so Thanks, Yeah. Would you say you're being triggered right now? <laughs> Just ask the question. Maybe she has Yeah, maybe you would actually know what I was trying to ask you if you listen for a second yogurt right now and you've got fucking expensive equipment you better watch the fuck out yeah, what are you gonna do damage my equipment i don't know maybe i'll I just eat this yogurt campus police and report you i've got cool all right this is getting i'm starting to get dizzy here i mean we're walking in circles now i mean this is pretty intense circles okay so can we just have dialogue no why i don't dialogue with fascists we're not fascists. Yeah, you fucking work for Alex Jones. Have how you does, listened to him? How recently? does that make us He's fascist? He's anti-government until Donald Trump gets. Are elected? you for free? Sp I have a question. Shut up, shut I'm up, trying shut to. Up, I'm shut trying up, to. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! I'm shut trying up, to actually up, have a decent shut up, conversation shut with up, you. I don't care. I don't care. I hate Alex Jones. I love. Are you for free face. speech? Woo! Alex Jones is a fucking freak. I'm trying to actually have a reasonable conversation with you, ma'am. And this is all I want to know. Are you for free speech? Like, maybe. No platform for fascists! No platform for fascists! No platform for fascists! No platform for fascists! No okay. For fascists! Can you define fascism? What's fascism? What's the definition of fascism, ma'am? Do you know what fascism is? It's easy. What is it then? Can you tell the viewers of InfoWars what it is? Maybe you have a valid point. Maybe you should share your views so that the InfoWars listeners out there can understand you, understand where you're coming from. Nah. So you can't define fascism? Of course I can. And what is it? I'm not telling you. Because I know you're not interested in listening. You're just here to fuck with students. I wouldn't be asking if you I know, wasn't interested. I posted some propaganda up here last night. American Vanguard propaganda. They posted it on a statue of a black woman, all right? So that's what I'm here talking about today. You're here asking about Hillary fucking Clinton. I don't give a shit about Hillary Clinton. I'm here talking about fascist propaganda. You don't care about the things that are important here. You probably support those motherfuckers. Fuck you. I don't I support care. propaganda, don't first support of all. Propaganda. No, this I don't. Propaganda. This is a different no, story. we're just having a conversation. No, this isn't. This, is this isn't. Oh, my what God. Yeah, what happened? 
Do you want to at least share the story about what happened? You could break the story on InfoWars. We're interested in knowing Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, I'll break the story on InfoWars, and all your commie-hating friends are going to comment. It'll be great. Cool. Have you ever been to a communist country? <laughs> Is there a communist country? You always like China. To that one. China's not fucking communist. It's state capitalist. So why do you think that America should be communist? Yeah, fuck yeah, America should be communist. Why? Yeah. What do you think it would fix? Do you, would you throw away the Constitution as a whole, or, or what do you want? Just a completely different government? Do you like your constitutions written by slave owners? Do you know what the Constitution means? Do you know it gives you your right to voice your opinion right now? It's a very simple question, ma'am. In a communist country, would you have free speech? Yes. <laughs> Yeah, free speech for us and no free speech for fascists. Would it be written down in a constitution? If you want to do some party building with me, you're very welcome. Get rid of the fucking camera. All right. So, interesting, guys. This is our um, interaction with some communists here on yeah. campus of University of Texas. They don't really... I mean, this girl's kind of talked to us a little bit, but, uh, I mean, I think we're just going to keep on moving on unless she wants to share anything specific with us. Well, it's easy to see why some UT students could be a little bit intimidated to voice their political opinions on campus when you have a group on campus like these revolutionary commie students who are very aggressive in bullying toward those who do. So uh, just over here, they were two booths, one with some girls selling Valentine's cookies and the other was the revolutionary commie students who were very hostile toward me. And they told the girls that they weren't allowed to talk to me and not to talk to me. And and they kind of refused to talk to me after having been threatened with that. So it's just easy to see that, you know, uh, political correctness and being told to not voice your opinion is making its effect here on campus. This is Millie Weaver signing off for InfoWars.com. Bing, bing, bong, bong, bing, bing, bing. Alex Jones here to tell you about how you can help spread liberty worldwide while also enjoying what I have found to be the best tasting 100% organic coffee on the planet. For more than a decade, my favorite coffee has come from the high mountains of southern Mexico, where the Chiapas farmers grow their unique shade-grown Arabica beans. We have now managed to secure these sought-after beans in a highly customized blend. Discover and try a bag of the Patriot Blend 100% organic coffee at InfoWarsLife.com. This coffee gives gives you a long, smooth pick-me-up for hours without the headaches and heartburn that so many other coffees give me personally. Hands down, this is my favorite coffee, and it's taken us years to secure connections directly to the Chiapas Mexican farmers. Drop by the site today, order a bag or two, and I don't think you're going to be disappointed. Available in original or with our immune support infusion blend, you will be supporting a free press, all the while enjoying a truly great-tasting cup of my favorite coffee. Available at InfoWarsLife.com.